Good Monday morning, everyone. The River Stage was rocking last night with a very special guest. The hit band 38 Special took to the River Stage last night, and the band, which got its start in the 70s, performed hits such as Rockin' Into the Night and Hold On Loosely. Many have been looking forward to this concert, as you can see the awesome turnout that it had. Ben will now head to Arizona for the next stop on their tour. San Angelo State Park gave locals the opportunity to take pictures of the wildlife at the photo walk this weekend. 60 photographers took part in the photo walk. An entry fee was waived at the park for registered walkers. The guided tour took photographers to get shots of everything from javelinas to longhorns. Um, it's for different levels. It's from beginners to professionals. It's people with a cell phone with to the people with, you know, $1,000 worth camera uh, uh, equipment. It's just a fun event um, for all photographers. There were also 10 Girl Scouts in the group earning a new badge. As Contra Valley Paws continues to deal with the Parvo outbreak this weekend, cats took center stage as they hosted their feline frenzy at Sunset Mall. Officials at the shelter say hundreds of cats are still available for adoption. This weekend, adoptions were free, along with free microchipping and vaccinations. Shelter officials want everyone to know that the Parvo outbreak has only put a halt to dog adoptions. However, cat adoptions are available. If you would like to adopt a pet, you can go to ConchoValleyPaws.org for an application and more information. Now let's see what's happening in weather with Taban Sharifi. Taban, a chillier start today, but what's the rest of the day looking like? We'll see those cooler temperatures, but also we're watching showers and thunderstorms throughout the region today. A high this afternoon of just 80 degrees. Those winds also feeling on the breezy side with winds out of the south gusts to 30 miles per hour. As we head into the evening and overnight tonight, a low of 65 degrees. We are watching the potential to see severe weather as we head into tonight. And what that means is damaging winds, large hail mounts, and we're also not going to rule out the possibility of an isolated tornado. Of course, we will continue to monitor that for you. Winds will be out of the south 5 to 15 miles per hour and as we head into tomorrow decreasing winds but still watching thunderstorms likely a high tomorrow of 79 degrees.